Today's game is coming to you live from Hexon, Texas at the raucous AK-47 Stadium, home of the $10 Bible beer and bullet combo meal. The crowd is armed, overzealous, and drunk, so basically a normal Sunday here in Hexon. This game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. No discounts in the MFL. The team storm the field. The Crooks and Skull Jugulars battle the Hexon Oilers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV. Oh, that's and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. That was a police state block in the bathroom because of the photographers in there. But other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. First down. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. That was a good throw, assuming he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon down there. First down! And this guy is a stud, Bricks. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. Second down and more. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> Second down and ain't going to happen, partner. Exploding baby diapers, Batman. That just knocked the ball loose. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. And the people who jump over those mines are steer clear of them. takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in palm grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. First and ten. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Second down and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personnel. If he was still talking, he'd be saying, 
Psycho killer Keska say, what the fu 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 fuck? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? Third down and long. Floyd Ray, because if you can't answer your question, well, as a quarterback, you have to take risks and just chuck the ball sometimes. But it doesn't always pay off, does it? Yeah, it Chuck. And he's off to the races. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? First and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second down and five. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just boom. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to fight it. point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. point but this guy could blow it it's good let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever
It's first and ten. Pick up three on a short pass. Second down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to rip the ball razors through the defense, cutting it, and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. You can't keep a good mute. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby Blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Second down and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Third down, and the punter is warming up. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Third down, and, well, good luck. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy Division. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Yeah, I'm still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Thank you. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just been straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> And 
It's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, he just got popped big time. Oh, my God. I thought his head was going to pop off like a big zit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Man, what a hit that was. Does anyone have a rule book? Because that sounds like he's making stuff up. Uh, do we have a rule book? It's propping up your chair so you can reach the table without spilling your food, idiot. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. And like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. That was something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he... Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Ah, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they are not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. Oh, nice hit. First and ten. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I do, it's when the game is on the line. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. make any mistakes here just kick the ball through the upright for god's sake it goes right through yeah like a double stop burrito from taco hell they're looking for a good return after giving up points let's see how they do yeah let's see if they always suck off that was just a one-time thing First and ten. And he breaks away. 
You ever get hit in the head with a bulldog? Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. <laughs> The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. Man, he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Come on, man, you gotta catch that. I don't catch it. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the NFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. And it's first and ten. Team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Hot, yep. Hot one. Did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh man, he read it. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is. Oh my God! A man from prison just came out of the field. That's the ref, you idiot. Let's see what the penalty is. And this is a first and long situation. And he's off to the races. Look at that little. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. You're like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football. He gets away in a hurry. <laughs> and it's first and ten. QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> First and four. 
Hot one, hot two. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's almost poetic, man. Like a haiku. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Just got crushed. And it's first and ten. some cash and the quarterback signals for a hurry up offense hey Grim, what's the hurry up offense there's no huddle the offense called and he sends him to the ground with it and whoever said never hit a man when he's down he's just plain lazy nice extra effort there and that'll be the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it he just cock blocked the clock And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Boom! Third and, and they are out of timeout. The clock just became their greatest enemy. Really? The clock? The clock, Grim? I can smash a clock. That's not a great enemy. We're not talking about waking up and crashing news. We're talking about the MFL, you moron. Destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. He did it! He scores! And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's at the 30, the 20. He's they're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. We got a sub up right now, this asshole. Try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. It's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Groundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning.
The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull crap and vodka jello shot day. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. case I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline the offense has only one quarterback left if he dies it's game over First and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, Rapow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. First and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. <laughs> and it's first and ten. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And the Hexon Oilers get crushed literally and lose by forfeit today. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Balin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.